All right, man and women, boys and girls, I hope you all are having a great morning, great afternoon, great day, great night, depending on where you all live at and where you all are from. As you men and women, boys and girls can see, I got a bunch of mealworms and beetles right here in front of me with some prepaid, like, little chipped off beetle, um, beetle wings from dead beetles. Uh, I also have my little top right here. So my family members can know, like, this is food for my leopard geckos, the beetles, and the mealworms. Um, and this is how I produce and make them. I got to feed the form. I got to feed this colony right here later on today or tomorrow. But to see prepay, to see prepay inside here, man, and women, boys, and girls, I like, look at that prepay. Look at that big prepay right there. Y'all see it wiggle? It wiggle, it moves. Um, there's another prepay right here. So that's good to see. I am about to add some more beetles and mealworms inside here. I am about to put some more inside here. And um, I have, I have baby Isis right here. I have baby Isis out with me, man, and women, boys and girls. I just fed her. She just ate like, she just ate like, um, I'll say she just ate like two or three mealworms like back to back she just ate like two or three of them so i got baby isis out with me and i have my new male leopard gecko out with me and i'm thinking about naming him loki but you all let me know what you all think a good name for him will be because right now i am thinking about naming him loki like loki's the name i'm thinking about naming him i was gonna do like um Louvie. Like Louie, like 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 something like Louis, almost. But I was like thinking like Louie, like something like that. And then I was like, why not just like go with like um Loki? Um, I don't know where he is. Oh, there he go. He behind me. So he is like a little bit on the chill side, but he a little bit on the like more skirmish side too. Universe celebrity get goes. So I do have to like be careful with him. And then baby universe, baby universe is right here by the food bowl. Y'all can see, so I got some of my leopard geckos out. She looking inside the food bowl. She licking the calcium right now. Y'all see Universe being fat. We catching her red hand and she over there licking up the calcium. Look at her Universe leopard gecko. Just all in that calcium. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick some more uh, wax worms in there for you, Universe. She's so spoiled, y'all. I promise you, I got her like that, though. Like, I, like, honestly, I got her like that, man, and women, boys, and girls. Like, I got Universe like that, y'all. She is such... Such a beautiful like spirit inside of this leopard gecko vessel inside this leopard gecko body, y'all. Like honestly, like she, she a sweetheart. She's she's such, she's such a baby, y'all. She a sweetheart. She's so calm. She's so chill. She's so sweet. Like universe is such a sweetheart, y'all. Like she's so nice and so calm and so good. Like like and wonderful, great. Like all, all the above. Like all everything. Like good. And, like happiness and smiling. Like y'all. She she is so like good and so like great and wonderful like honestly y'all like she one of my best leopard geckos that i got baby universe right here she one of my best leopard geckos that i got like honestly you all like she is so good so yeah um i'm about to add the these mealworms inside here i gotta keep an eye on my male though here he go i gotta keep an eye on my new male leopard gecko universal leopard geckos come here come here man come here boy so yeah, man and women, boys and girls, like Universal Leopard Geckos, let me know why I should name him. Like I said, this is my new male. This is my new male Leopard Gecko. Now remember you all, I have a real territorial aggressive adult male Leopard Gecko named Flash. Flash is the most meanest, the most roughest, the most toughest out of all my Leopard Gecko males. Leopard Geckos that I have. Flash is like the number one like like flash is the alpha male if i was to take flash out of his enclosure if i was to go away to the other room and like take flash out of his enclosure and, like pick flash on his bed next to him like flash would catch his scent his drift one time and flash would like be on him flash would be on him like a hunter hunting the book like flash would like flash would like be on him like a hunter like tracking the book and like flash would like attack him like right off like this, it like this, it's no doubt about it. Like it's, it's no doubt about it. Like if I was, if I was to pick Flash on his bed right now, Flash would most likely try to kill him. Like honestly, Flash will try to kill him. 
So, yeah, this day, you so that gonna smile, Isis. I ain't see you wrapped in a um, luffy. Cause I got the one piece shirt on right now. I am wearing the one piece shirt. And the women, boys and girls. Got a little one piece, one piece shirt on, y'all. Yeah, so there's the picture of Luffy right there. Got it like a little one piece shirt on, y'all. And I ain't see her like folded up, like wrapped up under my one piece shirt. Cause she's so doggone tiny. So I uh, just, but one thing, one good thing about Isis though, like she don't leave my side. She usually like try to like hide, like like I said, like she'll fold herself up. She'll fold herself up under my uh my shirt, man, and women, boys and girls, or like right there, like like between like me and my feet, like she'll like hide right there too. She was just hiding under my shirt, you all, until like I moved, uh, moved my shirt looking for her. Like she was under that little. Under that little part. So now she just holding on to my hand with her little sharp claws. Okay, Isis, I'm uh I'm gonna put you down right here, baby. You can crawl you can crawl big right there if you want to, if you choose to. She gon she gonna do what she wanna do, but I gotta keep her in my um sight. Also men and women, boys and girls. So yeah, with my new male, he on the other side of my bed right now, um, under the cover. But yeah, man and women, boys and girls. Like I said, I was thinking about naming him Lovi at first. Like L O um V I. And then I was I, I was like, why not just go ahead like just name him like Loki? And I was thinking like of some more names to name him. But you all let me know what I should name him. I should upload a little short clip and um post him because I haven't posted him since I had uh bought him because I've been letting him like chill. Like get like real like used to like his enclosure like the food like the water bowl and all it. Um, let me know like what 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 do you all think a good name would be for him? Like, like I said, I was thinking about like going with like Lovi at first, and then I was like, nah, I just go with, like Loki. I just named him Loki, cause he real. He not he not like Loki like from all uh, the comic books like Loki from like the Greek um mythology he not like Loki like real like mischief and like up to no good like no nah, this not him like uh it just like got some more like to do with, like low key like you know how people be like low key like laid back like low key like that that's why I want to name him Loki it has nothing to do with Loki from Greek mythology like from the comics like like Thor brought a Loki like no it it it's a, it it, it, have, it has nothing to do with that. I was thinking about naming him low key, like actually like the word low key, but instead of like low key, like L O W, then like K E Y, like you know, like instead of like low key, like that, it was like more so like just L O K E, like just like low key, like low key. Cause like I said, like he real like chill. He's not a aggressive leopard gecko at all. Like honestly, like. He real chill, man, the women, boys, and girls. Like, he real, like, laid back. He real, like, calm. Uh, He haven't showed no signs of aggression yet. Matter of fact, I just got him from where he was hiding it over there on the other side of the cover. So here he is again. I just reached over there and flipped the cover back. As you all can see, little Isis right here, man, the women, boys, and girls. I have my little baby little 60 female leopard gecko, Isis. She right here on my knee, just sitting here chilling, y'all, being pretty. So, with that being said, men and women, boys and girls, um, I'm about to add some new uh, mealworms and beetles inside this form right here. But, yo, you all, let me know what you all think a perfect name will be for my new male leopard gecko right here. Because uh, I was thinking about going like low-key, like just L-O-K-E, low-key. But you all let me know what you all think. Uh, a good name would be for him. Universe, you in this food bowl, baby. Man and women, boys and girls, you in this calcium universe. She is licking that calcium up, y'all. She tearing that calcium up. Universe, girl. I'm, I need to hurry up and like do what I need to, um, what I need to do and what I have to do and what I got to do, man and women, boys and girls. I need to go ahead and like add the new uh, mealworms because they on this plate right here. I just took them off the plate there inside this container. I will be adding these new beetles 
and mealworms inside of this uh form inside of this colony right here and um i need to get some wax worms and go and put some wax worms inside that food bowl for universe because y'all see how she is over there like she like where the good is it where the good is it man like come on like where the good is it you know what i want you're right universe i do know what you want i know that you want the food girl i know that you're looking for the wax worms so okay um okay okay i got you i'm going to set this right here man and women boys and girls and right now what i'm doing i got this container that i told you all that i'm about to add inside of the colony i got this container right now so universe just went behind a little clip she just went behind the little um the little top so she done like looking for food and asking for food right now like she done universe universe and gave up y'all she like forget it so i'm about to add the uh mealworms and beetles inside of the colony let me see yeah i'm about to just add them inside the colony real fast push some of the beetles all the beetles that are alive like just push them inside there i gotta feed this colony later on today uh let me see that prepay doesn't look good. Let's see if this prepay good or not. This prepay it doesn't look like it's alive. It could be though. It could be alive, man and women, boys and girls. But it doesn't look like it. I don't know that prepay. It, it doesn't look like so healthy like neither. It supposed to wiggle like right off when I grabbed it. I'm trying to get any like movement, like self movement out of it, and I can't. I cannot get no self movement out of it. So I put it over there, man and women, boys and girls, like. It don't look like, it don't look like so healthy. It don't look so good. So let me get most of this shit in. Let me get most of this shit out the way. Get most of this out of here. And any little dead, uh, dried out exoskeleton of mealworms, get them out the way too, also. Uh, that's it. Yep, it look like that's it. Because that's a live mealworm right there. Okay, the container is definitely ready to be added inside there now. Everything in here look live. And I'm not trying to get sprayed by the beetles too. Like when they musk, um, the defense um, mechanism, when they musk, like that musk, it do be strong, y'all. It's a lot of live beetles inside here too, man, and women, boys, and girls of Universe Celebrity Geckos. It's a lot of it's a lot of live beetles inside there and some mealworms. This mealworm container right here is just only for food. Uh, I don't know if it's some beetles inside this one. I really don't know. Let me see. This one. I don't know if it's um some, some beetles inside here. No, I know it's a lot of mealworms in here. Though it doesn't look like it right now. Because I just grabbed some out earlier to feed to the baby leopard geckos. But there are some mealworms inside this container right here. But yeah, this container right here is going to be strictly for food anyway. Look who came over here, y'all. Baby Universe, this girl right here be on it. I told you all, she's so spoiled, man, and women, boys, and girls. Now she looking at the colony. I'm about to get you some wax worms, mama. I promise. I'm about to get you some wax worms, Universe. Hold on, baby. Like... Man and women, boys and girls, this is how comfortable like you all need your leopard geckos to be. This is how comfortable and how trustworthy you want your leopard geckos to be. Like you want your bun with your leopard geckos and your leopard gecko buns to be with you. Like you want them to be like this trustworthy and this comfortable around you. You do not want them to always be like alert and grumpy. Because I have a male like that. My all white Diablo, my all white Diablo Blanco male named Trouble. That's what I named him, Trouble. My all white male, Diablo Blanco, male trouble. That's what I named him, man and women, boys and girls. And he do not like to be touched at all. Like, for long as I had him, like, feeding him when he was that doggone little when I first got him and got him, like, big, like, to, like, midway, like, adulthood to, like, the way he get now because, like, he's so doggone big now. And he still do not like to be touched, y'all. Like, he is so grumpy, but I'm hoping that when he get older, like, when he become, like, an old man, let me get go, when he become older, older, like, flash and void, I'm hoping, that, like, I'm hoping, like, he will grow out of it by then, like, when he get older, man, and women, boys, and girls, because cause of right now, yo, trouble, like, my little Diablo Blanco male trouble, as of right now, he do not like to be touched at all, and uh, I just, like, pick the food. 
inside of his enclosure. Uh, he know he know the process now because he go right to the food bowl. As soon as I put the food in there, I sprinkle on the bowl. Like I, I get a bowl, a tap against the um enclosure, and like as soon as he hear the sound and he smell the food, he smell the food. He come over there running like he come running right over there and then like he um he clears the food bowl like. I just fed trouble earlier, and he cleared the food bowl. Like, my little male Diablo Blanco, that one thing I like about him. Even though he is really, like, stubborn and always in the mood and don't like to be touched at all or don't like to be handled at all, the one thing I do like about him, he eats food. Like, he eats his food, man and women, boys and girls, and Universal let get go. So he eats his food. Okay. So Universe over here with Loki, bitch. As y'all can see, he had it um, on my feet, just chilling. He just sitting right there hiding on my feet. And she, she waiting on him to be fair, y'all. Look at that color. Look at that color, man. That women, boys, and girls, and universe celebrity go with that pattern. Look at that pattern, y'all. Man, I can't got to turn this alarm off. Look at that pattern, you all. Look at that beautiful pattern. That super snow um, pie eclipse. Super snow pie eclipse. Look at that color, y'all. Ooh, universe knows she pretty. She knows she pretty. I got you, girl. I got you, baby. Hold on. I got to pick done. I got to get done updating this colony. Putting, some, uh, putting these new beetles inside this colony. I know I got to feed them later on or tomorrow. I got to work out, too, and then get ready to go to work later on today. Men and women, boys and girls, like, I promise, like, owning, like, leopard geckos, like, feeding leopard geckos and taking care of leopard geckos. Me and other pet parents be talking. When I be talking to other, like, random, like, pet parents at um, PetSmart or Petco, like, we all be agreeing, like, taking care of your pet reptiles or taking care of your pet dog, taking care of your pet cats, like, taking care of your pets, like, in general, like, overall, like, taking care of your pets is, like, they, they are like your kids, like, honestly, like, I'm pretty sure it's a lot of, like, uh reptile parents out there they can agree with me and the other um reptile parents that stay saying like having pet reptiles is like having like kids like you taking care of them like it's 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 it's, it's kind of like having like kids so i just added like the new beetles and um the new mealworms inside of this colony um i gotta get some wax worms for baby universe because as y'all can see like she just ready to scrape and eat any little thing that move, y'all, she is on it. I should have had a second pair of uh, mealworms out already. I mean, waste worms out already, like a container. Hold on, universe. Come on, Loki. Mm -hmm. oh, universe, you better not bite my finger, girl. Ouch, ouch. Universe, ouch. She bit my finger, man, the women, boys, and girls. Okay. I'm going to get some waste worms. I will be right back, universe. I promise. I'm coming right back. I got the container ready, universe. Look what I got. Come here, big girl. Okay, I'm going to pitch you way over here. You can just walk over there when you smell them, which I know you're going to do anyway. I know you're going to come way over here once you smell them. So, here you go, Loki. All right, you can get back in your little spot, man, where you was at. It's all good, Loki. Okay, man, and women, boys and girls, so... I have the container of wax worms now. This right here is empty, but I definitely need this for um pre-patient stage. So I just I'm, I'm gonna keep that little container right there, that empty container. Definitely need that one. This is strictly food. Okay, so I have the wax worm container. Now it's time to um go through this, men and women, boys and girls. Now it's time to go through. The waste worm container and get all the good ones out of there for baby universe right here. Because as y'all see, she was tearing that food bowl up earlier. She was licking the calcium inside this food bowl. So I know she asking for food. And I'm going to go ahead and like, deliver for her on it. So yeah, uh, I put the top on the colony. I will be feeding them. We'll be feeding them later on. Let me set that right there. 
And time to pop open this waste worm, Mr. Pony. See how many waste worms we got inside here? That is alive for baby universe. Oh, that smell. Woo! That waste worm smell, y'all. It give me every now and then. Please, oh yeah, man. Two pain right there. Wax worm right here. Oh, I dropped it. There we go. I gotta shake them down in calcium too for baby universe. Go ahead, get ready to feed her with that. Let's see what else. I don't see. No more, okay, so spread it out. Um, this is another prepay. Man, that's a lot of them. They're getting ready to turn into moths, too. It's, it's glad that I opened this container when I opened this container. I'm glad that I chose this one, too, because all these little waste worm prepay, they are getting ready to turn into moths. I'm glad I chose this container, you all. Then I got to start hand feeding Loki, too, to get him like more like get him more like used and like comfortable uh with me and like hand feeding exercises i gotta like do it more often with him i gotta do it a lot with him to get him more like used to it okay uh let me see let's see because sometimes i'd be overlooking them i found one right here there we go uh, don't go too far, Loki. Come here. I gotta keep you in my. I, got, I definitely gotta keep you on my sight. I know universe not gonna go nowhere or baby Isis. I definitely gotta watch you though, Loki man. This this your first time like being out on my bed. You definitely might try to like make a break, make a run for it. No, oh, little Loki. I have to keep my eyes on you, man. No, definitely. Come here, universe. I'm almost done searching this container, girl. Pouring some more out on right here. It's not many, like, it's a couple of live ones in here, then. Like, it's a lot of them that's, like, pooping in, too, that's getting ready to turn into mouse soon. They need to look at coons, they're getting ready for turning to mouse soon. So, I'm glad that I came to this container. Like, I grew up this container. I'm glad I chose this one. Cause the longer I would have let it sit without like, without going to it to um, explore the food option for my geckos, uh, I would have like opened it definitely one day and like, or I would have looked at it one day and definitely seen those mouse flying around in there, and like knowing how I get, I would have just been shaking my head, like oh, oh man, this one got some mouse in there, cause they be annoying universal let gecko like I done had it like. A couple of times where it was a big surprise, like as soon as I opened the um container, like the mouse flew out of there. And like I said, like it was like real like annoying. Cause they be flying all around the room and stuff. Okay, so you see, I don't really see no more. A lot inside here. Let me move all this out of the way. This last little clean little pot right here. Okay. So I entered this container. Men and women, boys and girls. And see. It might it might be some left over in all this right here. All this like right here. It might do be something left over in there, men and women, boys and girls, but if it is it too small for me to see and I just didn't see it. Or I overlooked it so well then, like, but everything over here on this side in front of me, um, I do see. I still have my little new male Loki right here on my leg. I know universe behind me because I just felt, I just felt her um crawling down my back. So yeah, and I know what baby Isis is. She right here in front of me under the um the little cover. So yeah, this is. It, this is all that's in here for them. Like, good. Only one more left that's moving, and there's this one. Yep. All right, so I'm about to feed my geckos. Oh, here go another one. Just hiding. Look at it. Hiding inside the subscrape. Hiding inside the little subscrape. I'm about to feed 
my leopard geckos, men and women, boys and girls. And um, I'm about to like shake that down with some calcium. Like I said, I got my male leopard gecko named Loki right here. My new male leopard gecko, you all named Loki. Bet you all let me know what a good name would be for him, Universal Leopard Gecko. Because I'm always open to name options and name suggestions. Like, honestly, like name suggestions and like name options, like different options or different names. Like, I'm always like open to new ideas or like new names for uh, new leopard geckos of mine. So, you all let me know, like, what a good name. You all think would be for this little male leopard gecko right here. Come on, universe, because that she trying to crawl up my back. What is you doing back there, girl? I can't reach you. Like I know she on she on the back of me doing something. Wait, wait, universe. What is you doing back there? But yeah, man and women, boys and girls. Um, what do you all think a good name would be for my male leopard gecko? Cause like I said right now, I'm thinking about naming him Loki. Uh, this is him. This is how he look. Yep, that's my male, my little new male named Loki. But you all, let me know what you all think a good name suggestion um would be. A good name would be, and I'm about to feed him and baby universe and um little Isis, and I will see you men and women and boys and girls in the next video until then stay safe stay blessed out there uh feel free to like comment and um subscribe and i will see you men and women and boys i will see you men and women boys and girls in the next video and happy holidays to you all happy holidays out there to you all wherever you all are from just happy holidays remember to be careful out here in this world Try your best to be careful and stay safe. And I will see you men and women and boys and girls in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe, and we are done.